Andrew bolts for Balmoral. Prince quits Windsor to join his mother on her Scottish holiday to avoid attempts by U.S. lawyers to serve sexual assault papers. Here's a summary of the article. Prince Andrew has returned to the Queen's Balmoral estate to allegedly avoid multiple attempts to serve sexual assault papers at his mansion nearly 500 miles away in Windsor, it was claimed today. Advertisement, Andrew has not yet responded to the bombshell lawsuit filed in an American court by Jeffrey Epstein's former sex slave Virginia Jufre, who claims the Duke sexually abused her when she was 17. It comes around a month after 61-year-old Andrew also spent time with Sarah at Balmoral on a previous visit from August 10, along with his daughter Princess Eugenie and her husband Jack Brooksbank. Papers have not yet been served on Andrew or his lawyers despite multiple attempts at Royal Lodge in the last fortnight, according to reports, and the Duke is now set to stay at the Queen's estate when the case is heard. Ms. Jufre, now 38, claims she was forced to have sex with Andrew three times on the orders of pedophile financier Epstein. Ms. Gifra, 38, alleges that Epstein forced her to have sex with Andrew three times when she was aged 17. Andrew has strenuously denied her claims that she was forced to have sex with him on Epstein's orders. One leading criminal defense attorney said that while the term does not have any formal meaning in the U.S., the fact the FBI were apparently using it about Andrew was not good. The allegations against Andrew are not the only crisis unfolding for the royal family, as it has recently been claimed that the Prince of Wales was 100% behind an offer to help Saudi tycoon Mahfouz Mare Mubarak bin Mahfouz secure UK citizenship. This post received a score of 4,600, with an upvote ratio of 95%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. A coward of the highest order. When US lawyers reared their ugly head, Prince Andrew bravely turned his tail and fled. Underscore brave, 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 brave Sir Andrew underscore. How does going to Balmoral stop that? We have Rhodes, lawyers, postmen up here too you know? He's actually completely safe from any legal action regardless of where he is in the UK. He's just hiding from the press. I would have thought your comment is correct. There's 0% chance of US lawyers serving documents on him. Is that even done in the UK? Kinda. Not like the TV shows though. The documents will have reached him by registered post. With a name like Pickled Egg I'll believe you. This serve in person thing is completely ridiculous and surrend. Greater than surrend what does that mean? I assume they meant to type surreal but had a stroke. Lol wow his private plate ends in doi for Duke of York face with rolling eyes. Andrew is obsessed with his status and feels completely entitled to it. It wouldn't surprise me at all if the doi was intentional. He got in a right fit over not being able to be an Admiral IIRC. Imagine being his age and having to run away to hide at mommy. Isn't this also what that affluent kid did? Affluent kid? You mean the rapist Brock Turner? I think they're referring to Yar Boy, Ethan Couch, who, while driving drunk and high, killed four people and injured nine more. He was initially only sentenced to 10 years probation because his lawyers successfully argued that he has affluenza and that his parents were too rich to teach him that his actions have consequences. Later, he was videotaped drinking at a party, violating his probation. He then hid in Mexico with his mom, using a fake ID. He spent about two years in jail. The rapist Brock Turner is a scumbag, and yard boy Ethan Couch is a murderer. Edited to add link. His parents were too rich to teach him that his actions have consequences, so what we should do is make sure that his actions don't have consequences. That judge. That judge will be surprised Pikachu faced when Ethan murders someone else in another Dewey. We can only hope that it's the judge. God he has such a punchable face. So true. Years ago when people told me there was a royalty, Hollywood person's pedophile ring, I used to think they were crazy conspiracists. Now it becomes clear just how corrupt the world is, that he is still getting away with this bullshit. If I stole a Mars bar from the spa I'd get locked up. Yet this piece of shit has openly visited Epstein's fuck Palace Island on numerous occasions and Jack is done about it. Crazy world. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.